Hello Traders. Welcome back to another video, in this video we will be going over how to set up alerts for trusted signals indicators, as well as go over the alert types you can set up. To set up alerts go to the clock on the right hand side of the screen. Click the plus label and select which indicator you want to set an alert for. To receive an alert whenever a sell signal or a buy signal appears set the notification for buy or sell alert. In the options tab click once per bar close. This means that the candlestick has to close with a buy or sell signal in order for you to get an alert. Then set what kind of alert you want. Notify on app. In order to get notified with an alert on your phone, you first must download the latest trading view app from the App Store or Google Play. Show pop-up. A pop-up message will appear once an alert is triggered. If this option is enabled, a pop-up message will appear, even if you are browsing in another tab. For this feature to work properly, please allow trading view to show desktop notifications. Send email, an email will be sent to you when an alert is triggered. We will use the email address in your trading view profile. Webhook URL, webhooks allow you to send a post request to a certain URL every time the alert is triggered. Play sound, once an alert is triggered, you will hear a sound. Send email to SMS, use this option to receive notifications on your phone. Email to SMS is the easiest and absolutely free way to send text messages, SMS, from the internet to phones. This site aims to be the most complete and up-to-date list of international email providers that can be used to send text messages to phones. After you set the alert it will be in the alerts tab as active and you will receive notifications based on what you set them to. You can also add more alerts for other trusted signals. To do this, go back to the clock and add another alert but this time select the other indicator. And set the parameters. You can also add an alert by doing to the indicator. Right clicking and selecting an alert. You can select to receive alerts for all functions of the indicators. The easiest alerts to select for the divergence oscillator are the any regular or hidden alert, as well as, the entering and exiting channel. Once you select the alert for entering and exiting the channel. Edit this upper bound and lower bound value to fit your strategy. And do the same for the exiting channel. Select once per bar close. And set the alert type to how you would like to receive alerts. And hit save. You will now receive alerts for whenever the oscillator enters or exits the channel. Which will free your time and give you a break from the charts. If you happen to change your divergence oscillator to the RSI for example. You can see that the alerts seem to disappear but they do not. They are still active, which then allows you to set alerts for this as well. To do this right click on the RSI indicator and set the alert to RSI. Set to be notified when the RSI crosses above or below the 30 or 70 levels. Set what alerts you want to receive and click save. You now have alerts set for your strategy. Ok traders, that is all for today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss any future strategy and guide videos. Be sure to join the discord group where we give out signals, hold giveaways, learn, and profit together. All links for trusted signals will be in the description below. I will see you in the next video.